Being a trader is not for everybody, and this is the opposite of what most gurus and mentors online are going to tell you. They're going to tell you that anyone can be a trader and that anybody can become rich trading the Forex markets, but this is the opposite from the truth. The reason that they're telling you that anybody can do it is because they want anybody to buy their course or buy their mentorship. They're not saying that in the best interest of you. And I'll be the first person to tell you, if you haven't heard it before, that it's okay to not be a trader. There are a lot of people out there that want to get into trading because they think that anybody can do it and that you could just make a ton of money. But the problem is you start trading and then you realize that it's not really your thing. You're not really into it. And there's a couple of reasons why. The very first reason is that you're taking on risk. Some some people are more open to taking on risk than others. Some people are pretty scared of risk. They're risk adverse. Some people are very open to taking risk. They don't care about risking money every single day. So if you're the type of person that does not like risky things, then trading might not be for you. The other reason why trading isn't for everybody is because it takes time. A lot of people don't want to dedicate a year, two, three or five years to something without the assurance that they're going to become successful at the end of it. That's why people will go an easier route, something that's more safe. You know, you go to college for a couple of years, you're guaranteed to get a degree and then you can definitely find a job with that degree. But trading, there are people that trade for years without making any serious money and not everybody is okay with taking that risk. It kind of comes back to risk, but it's the idea of your time horizon. Are you gonna play the long game? Are you okay with being a trader and learning and becoming better and not really seeing any results for a couple of years? If you're not okay with that, then trading isn't for you. A lot of people will hop into trading expecting to make a couple thousand bucks in their first month or their first three months, and then it doesn't happen, and then they're extremely let down and they realize trading isn't for me. So if these things don't sound good to you, then like I said, maybe trading isn't your thing and you shouldn't waste time, waste energy, and waste money getting into it if you know out the gate that yeah, this probably is not the thing that I wanna be getting into.